You've done the hard work of identifying your target customers, crafting relevant messages, and launching campaigns to nurture those relationships. Your next step is to measure the success of your marketing campaigns using metrics. As with any business system you implement, you need a way to hold your marketing campaigns accountable. When you see what's working, you can reinvest more of your resources into those areas and grow your business even faster. First, you have to know your numbers. We'll get started by logging into mykw.kw.com, expanding the My Marketing menu, then choosing Manage and Create Campaigns. Here, you'll see an overview of all of the campaigns that you've saved or you've launched. The overview stats apply to all of the campaigns in that section, and the stats are averaged for all of the campaigns that you see. We'll explain the campaign statuses. Active means a campaign was activated by the user. Completed is the last step for a date campaign has run. Inactive is set by the system due to an error with a piece. The user must take action to fix the error, then reactivate the campaign. And new slash paused means the new campaign has never been activated by the user. You can view the entire campaign performance or click on the campaign to see the performance of individual pieces. We'll start by clicking on Review and Configure Steps of the Campaign to see the performance of an individual piece. The results will allow you to know where you are now and you can be purposeful about what strategies you'll use to increase your performance of the campaigns. Campaign performance is measured in two ways, open rate and click rate. Some tips to increase open rate are avoid looking like a spammer, avoid all caps and weird characters and subject lines. Make sure you're emailing an approved list. Don't purchase list to email. That's a surefire way to get blacklisted quickly. And write a caption that matches what your consumers would want to open. If there are certain pieces that get more open rates, then try to do more things that match those types of emails. Your goal is to ultimately not have them open your email, it's to have them follow a call to action and bring them to your website or send their contact information. You've mastered a way to prevent your emails going to junk and you've found subject lines in an email list that will respond to and open your emails. Congratulations, you've made great progress. What's the next step? It's to get the people who have opened your email to actually click through to your product. After all, the entire purpose of your email is to drive traffic to your website or an email landing page. Some ideas to increase click rates are a clean, simple copy, compelling calls to action, and use videos. If a client does decide to opt out of your campaigns, they will be taken to this page where they can update their home alerts, saved homes, and email settings, and they also have a chance to search for homes. If they choose to unsubscribe, you will receive this email. Tracking the performance of your campaigns can give you valuable insight to your customers. When you can see which marketing pieces work and which ones don't, you can tailor your future campaigns accordingly.